Hello, Summoners, and welcome to another episode of Phaeology, the study of Fire Emblem Heroes. Oh, all right. I am excited. I, I just finished workshopping a new little uh, uh, bit that we're going to be doing, and I... Oh, guys, it's going to be so great. I can't wait for you to see it. But for now, we're here for AR. Um, I've got no free summons today because, you know, it's... Well, maybe... It, no, no, I definitely don't. All it is is Byleth, right? Right? Yeah, okay. So we gotta wait on that till Monday. Um, defense results, last I checked we had one. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's a failure, but four foes defeated. I'm I'm surprised they took that. Uh, but you know, I some weeks, some weeks it is like that. Yeah, hey, um, let's go ahead and get started. Hey, a quick reminder, um, if you're liking what you're seeing, hit the subscribe button. I, it, it means a lot to us here and helps quite a bit. But in the meantime, let's be channeling Spring Sharena. All right? And proceed. Tier 32 with good old Ella Wood. A lunge Ella Wood at that, but not resplendent. Um, oh, I don't like that unit. Okay. So we've got Fallen Edelgard at plus zero. We've got Saros at plus one. How do I ensure that Lynn doesn't ruin my day here? That is the question, because that's not so bad if we talk about once. Um, if we talk about getting hit multiple times, that's a different story. Um, Ellawood, I've done Sims. I don't think this is the one that survives Black Knight, but it's possible. The, the catch there is since we've got, oh man, I do not like this person. Pot's on the other side, <laughs> come on. Um, <clears throat> sorry, so uh, since we've got near save, even if he hits twice, I'm just not worried about it. <sighs> and because of special fighter, he won't charge gale force. Let's figure out this win. I mean, is, is there any possible way we can hit that? Dance. Snipe Lynn. Because that would be amazing. <sighs> and slightly epic, if I do say so myself. I think that's what we want. We've only got three ranged units here, so Black Knight is covering us quite a bit. Do we have a turn one force? We don't. So there is a chance for us to get set up because really what I would like, I, would, I think Black Knight sitting right there is probably optimal. Well, I, Summoners, we might not even need like, Step up, hit, dance. We could have Black Knight right there so that he guidances in. And then we could rearrange. Um, as long as he has dragon effectiveness, I'm not particularly worried about Saros. And Edelgard's only gonna be moving one, but again, with Black Knight, I'm just, I'm not that worried about Edelgard. I think that's gonna be the way to go. All right, My here we go. Judgment. Yeah, I like that. Um, we're not gonna be able to take Thracer off the map this turn, probably. Uh, I think you actually have to be there. So let's hit, dance, take her out. Move Black Knight in. Um, and I mean, even if Peony attacks Black Knight, I'm just, I'm not particularly worried about it. Um, the pots are gonna be an issue. I mean, just flat out. That's that's gonna be a problem. Do we have any other movement shenanigans? I mean, I, I'm seeing Peony, of course, has all sorts of stuff. Um, Peony will probably attack Sharina, is that true? I don't know if she has enough oomph to. 
All right, Summers, I think this is the way to go. Despite having my phone on Do Not Disturb, a phone call got through and completely kicked me out. So, interesting, we're back. We're trying to remember what this is. Let's just check this and click. All right, all right, all right, all right. Yeah, that's where we're at. We were just about to do the thing. Um, Okay, so here we go. I'm back. Slightly out of it now, but back. <laughs> All right. Tactics room hit. Close your eyes. Dance. Good, good, good. That's what I was hoping. All right. It was just a small amount of worry that perhaps I was going to have an issue. Hmm. I'm wondering. Okay, so I think we just broke the whole seventh unit thing. So I think Thracer actually moves this time. I, I don't remember to tell you the truth, but we're about to find out. What is um, your let's get everyone in a nice range. Yeah. I won't lose. There is but one future. All right. Now, again, the problem is getting the pots. Let's see who moves first. There we go. Eh, 35. With Black Luna, though, I think that does it. No, not even close. That didn't do Black Luna because I always forget that Ellawood has a cooldown reduction on the, uh, yeah, or, or the guard effect. Always. Every time. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, the only problem there is I'm worried that uh, Black Knight got hit a little too hard. That is an issue. Um, who do we have with Dragon Effectiveness? Yes. That's exactly what I needed. Um, let's see. I mean, we can definitely get one pot out of this, for sure. Uh, I, I was wondering if there's any way we could avoid using Seether Shell here, but I don't think that's the case. Well, I say that. Never mind. There's definitely a way to avoid using Seether Shell. Um, I don't think we want Thracer sitting around, though. Yes. That We've got Smite. We could actually run up, hit her in the mouth, and then run away. Um, we've got to remember that Edelgard is on the move this next turn. Let's see. I'm a little worried about how much damage Black Knight took. <sighs> I was hoping for less. This may be fine, though. Okay. I think this is the way to go. Spring, spring, spring. Is it at all possible? Is it all possible to get Black Knight to that spot there? It is. Oh, that would be interesting. So basically, we would be, we would be counting on Here Black Knight to take on Edelgard. And the thing we would Understood. be counting on is the Here I go. special fighter. Oof, that's dangerous. Dangerous, dangerous thoughts. Um... Let's do it. What is your desire? I won't lose. So Thracer's gone. I'm gonna work this a little differently. Um, I was hoping there was a way. You know, there is actually a way to keep 
Edelgard off of that tile. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. What do you guys think? Um, yeah, there is. I don't know. That's dangerous. Okay. Um, I'm just going to try this. We're going to move this this unit right underneath Edelgard. Onward. We're going to move here. Onward. Here. This isn't kind of any kind of wacky Mirabilis, is it? Okay, good. Here I go. And then just sit right there. <sighs> now, the kicker is she's going to get yes. three. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Mir uh, Mirabilis is going to come down and hit Sharena. I am the answer. So we should be good there. Oh, this is so nervousing. Okay, okay, okay. Come on now. Here we go. Wow, that is a chunk. Zero. Yes. Oh, this is the week of zeros. But she's got bonfire this time. Oh, bonfire. Oh, bonfire. Um. Oh my God, down to six. Oh. But no damage taken. Oh, man, that is bad. Oh, that is not bad. Oh. Bolt Tower, how I love you. <laughs> Does he do it? He doesn't do any damage because she is just buffed as all get out. Um, <laughs> geez. You can still take one more hit from Mira, I think. Oh, what are we going to do there, though? That's, like... That first damage reduction is tough. Uh, I'm wondering if Asherah can break through it. Where did you pick up those extra buffs? Plus five, plus five. Does this give... Seriously, where did she pick up the extra buffs? And I mean, Black Knight's not going to survive another hit from that. That's, that's just not going to happen. Um, it'd be interesting to charge him up, charge up Black Luna. Do you really not take out Mira? Black Knight, you are failing me today. Wow, Black Knight never fails me. Yes. Um, how are we doing with Asherah? Because I think that's going to be the key to this victory. <laughs> um, all right, I mean, there's really only one chance for this, and that's Asherah. Um, how much resistance do you have? 49 is so much. Um, we've got 57, but we've got a lot of other stuff happening here. And I think if we just it will be done. give there is give Ashra a nice bump, Understood. we'll be getting some more out of this. Um, the question, of course, I mean, Here I go. Mira is doing ten damage already, so there there is a legitimate concern here that Mira is going to cause some havoc, <laughs> which is funny. That's the big concern is Mira. <laughs> oh, those buffs are killing me. If she had five less, uh, yeah, that would be much, much easier. Um, we have to take her out this turn, though. Like, like that's... Oh, come on! She's already at plus six, too. Dang it! Erg. Okay. Um, that's so close. Okay, this this has to happen, right? Because we have to get pots this time. <laughs> At least I think, do we have enough to get pots? So this is Reagan. Jeez. 
can we get can we get you out of the way? We might be able to run. Okay. I, won't I, lose. I think this is the way to go. Close your eyes. Over All right. Here. We have a nice pot. Does that? Oh, yes! Yes! Ashura coming in clutch. Oh, I thought I was going to get stalemated there. Oh, I was going to be so, so mad. Okay. Oh. All right, all right, all right. So we got that. We got that. Um, Is there a better way to do this? Like, do you? Because she has extra debuffs now. No, she doesn't really. <laughs> well, she kind of does. Um... I'm looking at, I think I can kick her out of the way, I think. There is but one future. You got 48 speed. How much attack do you have? I mean, you have a little bit of attack. That's 50. I am the answer. Yes, you are the answer, <laughs> Ashra. <laughs> that's, that's insane. So, I mean, the problem, the problem we're looking at now is that far save is going, or near save is going to kick in. She only does 10, though. And we're on a defense tile. Like, that math says we should be fine. Interesting. <laughs> I never thought I would have Black Knight running from Mirabilis. Like that is that is not a scenario that I had in my head for today. <laughs> um <laughs> Okay. We can back you out of the way and then we can smite Ashra up, but then we can't get we can't have Sharena run far enough. funny okay okay we can do the math here this is 50 we have enough defense to take this like there's there's no reason we should be concerned let's let's just take that pot should be fine let's back you out just in case oh no that's actually the last thing we want to do isn't it oh summoners that's the issue Okay, okay, we do want to back him out, definitely. Um, uh, Mira will try to take out Ashura, and Black Knight will swoop in to try to save the day because he's that kind of guy, you know, ignoring his game altogether. Um, 32, okay, good, 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 good. We can do this, yes! <laughs> we can kind of do this. What is this thing here that this... <laughs> Um, all right. Well, isn't that fun? Uh, yeah. Ashra, the savior of runs, yes. can you just do this? Yeah, so we've got both the pods and we're done. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe I almost got stalemated by, uh, by fallen Edelgard. <sighs> all right. All right, we made it. Barely, but we made it. Uh, that was a good run, guys. <laughs> All right, uh, let's go look at this defense map here. Or defense replay, rather, and see what in the world. Ha oh, I summoners. I've seen people do it well, but I, I've got to say it is really hard when you just stick four carries on a on a team. Well, and it's also really hard when you have a full row of, of buildings. 
Yeah, this is, I think we all know how this is gonna go. Um, interesting. Huh. So, there's a couple interesting things about this. I have actually swapped things around last night. So this person sat on this replay for air, er, sat on this match for a long time. Huh. Okay. Uh, oh, that hurts. Three short. But yeah, le legendary leaf or dual leaf is just gonna demolish this. All right. Good job, dual leaf. Good job. What else we have? Only five. Oh, bonus season Asher is just a monster. Um, as we just saw. <laughs> Maybe I need male Byleth. I I've seen so many people running around with her, or with him rather. Um, yeah, this is, at this point, it's just math. Well, no, no, they took this win, so they made it through. So Edelgard was able to take out everyone they needed to from here. Uh, they were able to keep two units alive. I don't know what two units those are. I guess bonuses and Ashra helped out here. Death from above. All right. I'm going to stop well, I mean, I, you know, like we said, sometimes you just got to take what you can get. Um, from here, we're just going to click through this because this is... Yeah, Ashra goes. Regan almost goes. Did they get pots? Okay, that the the tower helped, uh, the bolt tower helped a ton. And surely they got pots out of this, right? Yeah, okay. Here's where the pots came in. Oh. They're really running down to the last minute here. Wow. That was really close to losing another unit. All right, well, they, they pulled one pot out of it. Um, yeah, I, you know, some matches go that way. Ah, right, Summoners, I hope your week is going as lucky as mine with these just narrow margins of victory. But if you like the episode, leave a comment or subscribe. We have lots of stuff coming. If you'd like to reach out to the show, you can do so through our subreddit at r slash Phaeology. You can email the show directly at phaeology at gmail.com. If you'd like to chat, you can join the research and development server or direct messages on Discord. Our tags are in the show notes. Remember, you can send your voice messages through Anchor at anchor.fm slash Phaeology slash message. If you'd like to support the show, you can do so through anchor.fm slash Phaeology for as little as a dollar a month. Hope you have a wonderful day and schedule an appointment with your Phaeology just real soon. Take care, guys.